Hey guys, NES Evolution here, and I have a lot of X-Men to go through here today that I've just bought, picked up, whatevs, so we will go through these. First up is Coarse Air from the Phoenix Saga, and if I am right, Coarse Air is actually Cyclops's and... Cyclops and Havoc's father. If I'm... If I remember right. Let me know if I'm right. Corsair. Pretty cool figure. He's a pirate. He's a space pirate. It's kind of like Star-Lord, I guess. Next up is Omega Red. Um, and this is one I've been wanting, but his tentacle is like out of his hand. I don't know if I want to keep that, cause but it says they do adjust, so it says you push it, so maybe yeah, they slide out, so it's okay, it just fell out. So Omega Want Red, one I've been looking for for a while, and I have that one now, so that's pretty cool. Um, Next up is another one in the Phoenix Saga, which I was a big fan of the cartoon, the Phoenix Saga. And this is Space Wolverine, which my cousin Chad had this figure, and I always thought it was super sweet. Because um, I like the Wolverine, how his claws can come out, and he's like in a suit, space suit. I like that one a lot. Next up is... Oh yeah, Sabretooth, one a, a classic, and one of my favorites, for sure. Yep, classic and a favorite, and it comes with an Ultra Flare card, which those cards were like awesome in like the mid 90s, man. I had so many of those freaking cards. Next up is uh, Wolverine, and it's kind of like the... Um, before he, like, the Weapon X, kind of like, he was like the assassin for the government or whatever. And he has his blue costume on. I have one with a black costume. And I, I, uh, I grew up with one with a black costume. So, blue costume, eh. Don't care for the blue costume as much. Next up is Juggernaut, light up weapon. And this guy was like a big figure for back in the day. I had him, and I thought he was awesome. So, yeah, really cool. Always been a fan of Juggernaut. For sure. Next up is another Wolverine. Savage Strike Twist Action Wolverine. Kind of a lame-looking Wolverine. It kind of looks like they took Morph's body and put Wolverine legs on him and Wolverine arms and Wolverine's head. <laughs> So, yeah, Morph. I don't care for this Wolverine at all. I think he looks stupid. So, yeah, and he comes with a gun. When did Wolverine ever use a gun? I meant, like, at this phase of his career. Don't like it. Next up is... Next up is uh, Mr. Sinister. Power Up Light Blast. see if we can get that to light up because I know the buttons on the back but and something I just was like whoa I got two of him now but look it check him out red cape blue cape I like the uh, oh and this guy has a goatee and this guy doesn't so, they're totally, they're like different. See them? So, I'll have to look into that. I like this one better with the blue and the goatee. And, yeah, this is the one I had as a kid. The blue. The next one is one I've been looking for for a long time. And this is Apocalypse, the second edition. The best apocalypse as a kid. And it comes with interchangeable arms. 
a claw one and like a drill type thing, like a jackhammer. And you can take his arms off, and he just kicks kicks ass. Seriously, that's like the best apocalypse. They, I mean, they did their best modeling the build a figure after this apocalypse for sure. So yeah, okay, that's the X Men I have. I thought I had a couple more, but I guess not. That's what I have. That was several. Okay, guys, bye.